This season you've seen plenty of images of my vehicle travelling right around Australia. But what you might not know is that there has been another vehicle travelling with us every step of the way. And that vehicle is this Nissan Patrol over here. Now this is our crew car vehicle. So this is where we store all the camera equipment and tripods and all that sort of gear when we're traveling around Australia to grab you these beautiful images. We use it as a test bed to road test new and interesting products on the four wheel drive scene. And at the moment, this vehicle is testing the brand new Cooper AT3 tire. Now the AT3 just happens to be Cooper's best selling tyre and for good reason. It's an all terrain tyre, that's what the AT stands for and it's a very quiet tyre as well so on road you don't get that traditional roar that you'll get from a more aggressive tread. The tyre also features what they call a chemically bonded silica tread compound and this is really what all the best tyres are using at the moment and what it does is it increases the rubber's ability to mould to uneven surfaces which gives you much better traction in the wet and better handling on the highway. As far as strength of the actual carcass goes, it runs super tensile steel in the belts. This means that it's got much better impact resistance and puncture resistance as well. Now often, four-wheel drivers will look at a tread like this and they will run for the hills because a quiet tyre usually means a tyre that just can't cut it off-road. A tyre that potentially has a very soft belly and just won't handle it off-road. Well, after dragging these tyres through the Pilbara, the Kimberley, right through the centre of Australia and through some of the toughest tracks up the East Coast, I can safely say that's just not the case. And what really surprised me was the sheer lack of chips in the tyre. Often you'll come back from an off-road trip and that tyre will be in horrible condition with chips all over the place and lugs lost right off the tyre. But in this case, these tyres have come back looking almost as good as new. The AT3 really is quite a smart design because on every one of these tread blocks there are these little sipes cut in and that gives you that beautiful on-road traction, particularly on wet bitumen. But then you look again at the tyre and you'll notice that there are these little grooves that are cut into the tread blocks and stepped tread blocks as well. What that means is that off-road in the mud, that mud will find it extremely hard to stick giving this tyre really great self cleaning ability. So if you're after a tyre that is nice and quiet on road and around town, but you still want to belt up these fantastic dirt road tracks on the weekends, then you'd go a long way to get a better tyre than the AT3.